There is an important symbolic pro-life vote in the House tomorrow. We talked about it earlier with Tennessee Representative Diane Black, who has led the charge to defund Planned Parenthood. I have, and thank you, Brian, for asking about it. It is a very important vote for us. Um, there is something called budget reconciliation. Um, it is a little bit different because it only requires a vote of 51 members in the Senate. Um, I believe that we'll have that, and then this will go directly to the president. Unlike currently, uh, under their rules, there is a filibuster rule that takes 60 votes. And reconciliation is a little different. We can only use it in limited cases, and we are using it in the budget um, uh, reconciliation as well as placing Planned Parenthood on there as well. So it goes directly to the president, who is almost certain to veto it. Why vote? Well, because we need to make sure that we keep this conversation alive. Um, obviously, from the, the videos that we saw, the undercover videos, there are questions to be answered about the legality of what goes on at Planned Parenthood, especially in the harvesting and the sale of, of fetal tissue. And so we want to put the president on record. We want the American people to see how the president feels about that. And we feel this is a worthwhile measure um, to actually put it on his desk and have him defend um, not standing up for what we believe are illegal, uh, illegal activities that are happening in Planned Parenthood. And how does that advance the pro-life cause moving forward? I believe that the American people um, have been sold a bill of goods by Planned Parenthood. They've been told in the past, this is just a blob of tissue, this is not life. They believe that we've become numb to taking life. And what this does is it really opens the minds and the hearts and minds of people to say, we're not a nation that's going to put up with this. When you can harvest a brain, a liver, a lung, um, tissue from a baby, it's no longer just considered a blob. It is a baby. And the more that we can get this message out to the American people and have them actually see the truth of this, the better off we will be in changing the hearts and minds and the will of the American people to say no more. All right. Representative Diane Black from Tennessee, we appreciate you being with us tonight on EWTN Newsnight. Thank you very much for having me.